I think it's right there. Let's dig it out, huh? Some animal's been living here. Wow. Oh, wow. A double brush move? I've already done that. Pack with poo. They got a crack, do they? Oh, my bursitis. Hey. Hey, hey whoa, whoa. Oh, Lord. Don't you be looking at me staying there. Country girl can survive. I just saw a mouse. No, you did it. Where's the mice? We got some string beans in here. Oh my gosh. Is that a bone? What in the world? There's bones in here. What is died in here? No, I don't. Don't do a cussy slip. Oh, oh, oh. oh. That is a rat. So we got live action. I don't know. A skull. <gasps> got Rocky Cam going. That is so nasty. Complimentary rants. Okay. Ew. You nasty. Real nasty. I think you just made a volcano. You're in there, I'm coming. Gotta clean your cracks. Nasty, nasty. All you have to do is do this. If that rat pops out, I'm gonna laugh my head off. <gasps> She's full. Get out here. I'm lucky to be alive right now. No oh. way. Welcome back to the Sleeper Dude YouTube channel. Today, we're going to get another car. One that mom's excited about. Mom's excited about this one. It's not a Fairmont, okay? Yeah and the kids have no idea what it is but this is a car that we've owned before which is a new one for us really i don't think we've ever bought a car we, we had before on the channel this car is one that we did a i guess you'd say a will it start on and a clean it up and flip on when we were 19 years old so that for her that was 30 years ago <laughs> and, <laughs> You're not nice this morning. anyway we bought this the year we got married I, I wanted to keep it she wanted to keep it yeah i got the thing running and then it didn't run again. Well, I got it running. I remember having the valve cover off and getting the thing run. I was like, I'm going to put the valve cover on. We're going to drive it. Put the valve cover on. It wouldn't start up again. So it has some issues. And we sold this thing 17 years ago. It hasn't ran in 17 years. The reason I know that is I was the last person to start it. We sold it to a good friend of ours. And he kept it in the garage this whole time, which is very nice. It's a plus for us. It should be in pretty good shape. We have not seen it. Have we seen it since then? No. So we haven't seen it in 17 years. It's in their storage building. So he called me and asked me if I wanted to buy it back. And I was like, sure. So we're going to go now and get it. It's about a 45 minute drive to where this thing is in a really pretty part of Tennessee. So we're going to try to go get this thing. And the kids have no idea what it is. So we are going to uh, see if they can kind of guess what it is and surprise them with it. Now we'll tell you guys, it is a MG Midget. So I don't remember exactly what year it is. So we'll find out once we and get the car. Red, right? I think it's a red MG midget, yes. So, little tiny convertible car. So, let's get there and pick this thing up and see what the kids think about it. Now I know where the kids get it. My Crocs are in the, in the truck. Oh, oh, you got your Crocs in the truck? Okay. I had to go to the barn this morning. I didn't want to get them poopy. Hey, she got me brand new flops. Brand new ones. I can't believe it. You guys ready to go? Yeah. yeah. All right. So, guesses on what kind of vehicle it is. Santa, go hmm. car. Go kart? I don't know. No, golf cart. No, golf cart, samurai. You got a guess, Wawa? Some kind of Fairmont. <laughs> Some kind of Fairmont? Well, we'll see if you guys are right no, when we get there. My hope is it'll fit on the trailer. It's the biggest thing. Big thing. Like, I don't, I don't know. We've hauled some big stuff before. But I just don't know if it's going to fit on the trailer if we're going to take the ramps off. Like, faking something. Faking? Oh, Why would I fake that? Because. What if it's a samurai? Okay, I'll tell you this. It's not a samurai. I know you're wanting a samurai, Ralphie. Okay. It's not a samurai. Can we get hard eggs? Please, we need hard eggs, please. I knew. I knew if we got in the truck, I'd have to feed you something. Mama didn't make blackfish for me. Ah, uh, that's where my buddy Tim works. Ziegler Funeral Home. They're the last place that'll let you down. How do y'all talk me into this stuff, Wawa? Mr. Andrewfish. <laughs> Such a baby. Oh, yeah. See in the mountains. I think this is it. All right, guys, we're pulling up. Do you remember coming here, guys, before? What? Where is this? You rode a golf cart here. Oh yes, 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 yes. Oh I yeah! Did. Oh my gosh! Oh, so oh, close. What the heck is that? This is a vehicle we used to own. 
years ago. I think it's right there. I think it's underneath there. There it is. Oh, it's that little mini car? Yeah, it's a, it's an MG Midget. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You can get it. Oh. It doesn't even look like there's a car in here. It's so little. No, like. Can you believe how little it is? I, 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 I wasn't great. thinking about it. And it's uh, I, you can't even tell there's a car in there. It's so tiny. Well, let's dig it out, huh? Yeah, dig some stuff out of here to get to it. Huh? See a front bumper. I don't remember what year it is, honestly, without looking at it. It looks so small. So it don't fall out. Y'all see if you can get that. Yeah. It's got plenty of stuff protecting it. I forgot it had a strap on it. <laughs> wow. Is this a lot? What does that one look like? I want to go up love it? Yes. I thought you would like it. This is shutting the door, so open your door up. Oh my gosh, it's so little. I forgot how little it was. It looks like it might have a tiny bit of air in it, or maybe the car is just not heavy enough to squat it. I don't know. How heavy are they? It's going. Oh, it's going. Yeah, it is. Go out here. I think it's under the ground. Isn't it funny how they sink? Coming up. We're gonna have to dig in the dirt to find something to hook to. I bet there ain't no snakes in here. Stop it. <laughs> We might could pick up the front end. The spoiler kind of blocking it, but I think that'll work. I got me ripping my spoiler. <laughs> it may get bent just a little bit. It's a four speed. Uh, oh, something lived in here. I've got a nest. Oh, uh, God. We got some sort of nest back here in the back seat. Some animals been living here. Hopefully they've moved out by now. Hopefully, Ralphie. All right, now go. In, baby, in. Oh. I love it. Yeah, it's rolling. My side's rolling. Here's your dirt report. You can see 
where it was sitting in here. Some animal had been crawling in here, I believe, and living in it. I'm not going to run my hand in there and find out what's in it. I'm not. At least there wasn't any SNAKEs in here. Oh. Oh, what the heck? Oh, look. Something's been living in that. I wonder what that was. Probably a rat. Yeah. Big rat. Oh, look. We got some here. Look. There's like okay, a nest. Well, you can yeah. have them. Okay. We'll take that with us. All right. And Promosa is still kind of green, They're so green. Yeah. yeah. They've been living there recently. Yeah. yeah. There's probably babies in there. They're going through where the speakers were. They eat the speakers and going in and out they through there. Ate this. Yeah, they ate the top on that side too. Yeah. Oh, they've been living in here too. It's so small. Wow. Oh, wow. They have. Look, they ate up the plug wires and stuff. <laughs> wow. That is crazy. Do you like the dog better or the car better? The dog. <laughs> You know I want to drive that school. You love it? I, I love it. That, yeah. is my, that is my That is the best favorite. car in it. This yeah. is the best one. I was wondering Crazy, which... you like it? I was wondering which one of you guys would like it the most. I like it. No, I like Me. it more than you I does. love small no. cars. You haven't no. even looked at Marketplace once. I think this might be mom's car. No, this is my car. This what is my car. car. So he said after he got it from me, he got it back running and drove it one time down the driveway and then parked it. So he did have it running one day after I sold it to him, but that's the only time he said he had it running. I don't think they realized what kind of animals had been living in this thing. No. Nobody had opened it up in years, obviously, and something has lived in, I mean, it's really a triplex. There was stuff under the hood, stuff in the trunk, stuff in the car, so this is gonna be the biggest animal cleanup video. We're gonna have to clean up for parking my garage. It We're, can't go in my garage like that. Downtown Teleco here. It's a really pretty part of the country if you've never been here. You can get on the Chiraholla Skyway here. Love the cool water tower. I never wanted to sell a car in the first place. Yeah, she's always got mad at me for that I sold it. There's a, about five that I wish she hadn't sold. This is one of them. So I'll be excited to get this one going for sure. <laughs> kind of forgotten how little this car is like it's tiny. when i went to open i ain't even sat in it yet but when i went to open the door and stuff i'm like it's like at my waist the roof is like so short but it looks like the seats are still in good shape even though it's had Hopefully. animals living in it so i believe this is a 72 mg midget and it's got a four cylinder i had to look up what size four speed manual definite right This is definitely the smallest car we've had. I think the Starlet may have been really close. I think this may be narrower than the Starlet was here. Yeah. I think it's, it's, it's shorter. shorter. It's definitely shorter than the Starlet. Yeah. What are you doing? I thought we were supposed to be working. Well, I got to looking on Deal Dash. They're partnering with us for this video. And look, these people just bought a portable wireless speaker for three dollars and 63 cents they, they probably even got solar lights on here honey well hook me up <laughs> deal dash has been around for more than 10 years everything they offer is brand new overstock products that they bought and now they're passing on the great deals to you everything's free shipping and every auction starts at zero dollars so then every time somebody bids it only goes up by one cent it restarts the clock to 10 seconds so if nobody else bids you're the winner so there's been people on here buy PS5s for like 230 bucks. I mean, iPads for $33. People have even bought cars for less than a thousand bucks on here. So all you have to do is get the Deal Dash app on your phone, or you can go to dealdash.com slash sleeperdude on your computer. Once you've registered, you purchase a bid pack, and that allows you to bid on the items. They have over 20 million registered users, which is crazy. If you end up clicking the Buy Now button, you get all your bids back that you've used. Here we go, Texas Roadhouse gift card. It's only at $1.83. It's a $25 gift card, and it comes with 50 free bids. Let's put in some bids here. I'm going to put in five bids, and now it's going to overbid them for me. So look, sleeper dude right there. I was the highest bidder. Somebody outbid me. Now it's going to outbid them. So you don't even have to stand by. It just keeps bidding for you. 
So that's how easy it is. Every time somebody overbids me, it just goes right back and overbids them. So I can go away and whatever, eat a can of Vienas, come back and this thing's still bidding for me. That's really nice. You don't have to stand right over it if you put in your bid number like that. So there you go. That's how easy it is to use. Please go to dealdash.com slash sleeperdude. If you use promo code sleeperdude with your first bid pack purchase, you're going to get $10 in free bids. Big thank you to Deal Dash for partnering with us on this video. We really appreciate it. It enables us to do what we do. Now let's get back at it. This is the only signal she knows. Oh, that's good, that's good, that's good. Can't slide it? Lean it towards the goats and then slide the bottom over. There you go. I'm on your okay. I love its stripe too. Yeah, the stripe yeah. looks really good. It smells bad inside. I know. It's very damp inside here. It's so small. Oh, oh. Okay. We're good. If you're not careful, that door's gonna clip you. Love it. Looks like a racing one. What are we trying to do? Slide it. Oh, there we go. <laughs> it's so small. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's so little. Oh, There you go. Wait, can I push it by myself? Yes. Go, Ralphie, go. We might have a big animal around here. I'm getting away. But I lay in this seat for him, look, like, right up against the seat. I'm surprised they didn't eat the seat. Look at all the sticks he's hoarding up. Looks like something in that hole over there. There seriously the could be. It appears, it appears to have solid floors. This is not even turned brown yet. Like he's yeah, he's lived in there, there like yesterday. God, he's probably good. under. And look, look, you have one, two, three, four, five little homes there. Oh my gosh. It, terrible. it does smell it's, terrible. It does smell terrible. So it's been a minute. We got distracted with some other projects and some deadlines, but we're back. Mom's been on me like crazy to get her car cleaned up. So we're gonna try to push this thing out there in our cleanup spot with no brakes whatsoever. Hopefully we don't run into anything and try to get this thing cleaned up because everybody's wanting to drive it. Yes, please. I guess I'm gonna have to drive it in the mess here. Mm. Hopefully there's nothing down there that's a bite. I'm, I'm pretty sure Scooty's got them all run out. Give her a push there, I guess. Oh, wait, I feel like we need to get like a block or something ready. We're fine. I'll just steer it away from danger. Here's here we go. Oh. Same as a break, right? Yeah. Oh, sure. It's so tiny. I feel enormous in this. Thing. You look enormous in it. <laughs> no, we don't have a bit of brakes. Well, we might have a little. Yeah, I think I saw a little. Well, we might have a little bit of brakes. Maybe just a little bit of brakes. This is the coolest car on the property. It is. It is honestly. Can't even get out of right it. Right under my truck. My feet are like here. <laughs> when I get in it. And look how deep in the mud it was. Look, it's all the way up to there. We got a lot of work ahead of us. I don't think we have to pressure wash it, honestly, because awesome. I don't see much mold. I really. I think like I'm. I like take the seats out and I'm gonna take the carpet out because I'm not gonna ride around if it smells like rat pee. That's not gonna go. I think it's gonna have to be me and you cleaning this rat mess out just for safety reasons, huh? Probably. Oh, but, there's a wasper's nest down there. Yeah, there was a big one at my feet for sure, but. Let's walk around it while it's out here in the sun. We think the rack, Might I think that's our rack right there, but man. I really hope this, I think there's a big emblem or something that's supposed to go right here too. I hope it's in there. We gotta Hopefully so. through, make sure we don't toss it. We might have to get the hazmat out again, huh? Maybe. It's looking like it. It's very barn fine dirty, you know? I don't know why it's peeling on both sides right in the same spot right there. 
Got a little whiskey dent in the fender, but nothing to worry about. That is unbelievable amount of junk under there, but I don't even know what kind of carburetor. I think it's a Weber, just from the seeing the side of it, but it's kind of hard to tell. We got a lot of cleanup work too. Uh, is this worse than the rat car yeah, definitely. turbo cube? It's, it's at least a tire. I don't think we've ever had an engine this much. The Savoy was pretty bad. Remember it? It was pretty much covered, but I think this is worse. Yeah. I mean, we could see the carburetor at we least on the Savoy. See the spark plug wires are all I know, they're all chewed up. What? All right, well, let's get to washing this thing. Where should we start? I don't know. Well, we need to get our barn fine dust off of it before the weather does it for us, huh? Okay. It's probably going to take a few days to get this thing cleaned up. Definitely. It's not going to be a one-day thing. Do you think we'll see a mouse or a rat in this car? Do this? I hope not. Maybe a baby or a maybe, uh, maybe Maybe a dead Maybe one, a skeleton. Hopefully, we didn't infest our shop. Mm. Well, at least Scooter's there to take over and help us. Those doors are so... I don't think I've ever had a car well, with the door. door panels are really good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 100% waterproof. Yeah, this is the condition of our top. This is where they gained access to the vehicle, we believe. I'm just glad they didn't do that to the seats, you it know? Hopefully we don't find more It looks funny from the back. Yeah. Like, it's awesome. It's so awesome. All right, let's get to washing it before we run out of daylight. Let's get it. Check us out on other platforms at SleeperDude88. This version of the MG Midget is called the Mark III. It was produced from 66 to 74, and this exact body style with the rounded rear wheel arches was produced from 72 to 74. They have the 1275cc engine borrowed from the Mini Cooper S, and it only has 54 and a half horsepower and 67 pounds of torque. After 74, they went to big rubber bumpers for safety reasons. And these things only have an 80 inch wheelbase, 48 and a half inches tall, and only 1,625 pounds. Are you ready to clean your car up, I'm Mom? I'm ready, I've been waiting for this.
You know, you started out strong there, but then uh, I had to come in and rescue you with a pressure washer. <laughs> Definitely not waterproof right now. No. A lot of water got on the inside there, but I noticed it changing colors as we were washing it. It, it, it had a lot of dirt and a lot of mold on it that yeah, came off. Yeah, it looks better now. It already does look better. That was probably the quickest car to pressure wash I think I've ever pressure washed. <laughs> so it should be about the quickest car to brush wash too, but... She washed a little paint. Yeah, there's more bubbles than I'd like to see. I didn't know those were there, or those were there, or those were there, but what it's not a big car to paint though. What's that, what running that? out? Running out. Probably nasty rat mess that got wet, I'd guess. I don't know what that is. Something nasty's running out of the quarter, so. Gross. Grody? That's disgusting. <laughs> So now we're going to brush wash this thing real quick. Uh, it shouldn't take too long as tiny as this thing is. Who's wanting to drive this thing? Me. Me. Nope. Majorly me. Squeeze isn't even wanting to drive I, this? I, 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 I don't know. want to drive I've it. always wanted to shift the car from first I feel like second. I'm going to kill myself. You haven't ever done that? But, no. You have with me when I was driving. Yeah, but not, not like clutch. I, I need to learn now. All right, well, let's get to it then. It ain't got very big casings, does it? It may have the little falcon beat, though. I think they may be wider than what's on the Falcon. Maybe it's just because, uh, it's probably just because the car's so little, they look wider to me. Get them casing shined up. Them was new back when they parked it. Yeah, I, I wonder if he replaced them. I don't remember if it had new ones on when we owned it or not. I wonder if the steel wool will take that rust off there. I hope so. I think those are painted hoops, so. I plan on fixing this one up. You gonna fix it up? Yeah, I'm gonna touch up the paint. Okay. I may be the one who gets it started. What you think? Maybe. Think I could get it going by myself? We'll see. Or redo the brakes by myself? Maybe. I Man, they put MG all over it, didn't they? Yeah, every every. Everything there. says MG on it. <laughs> they wanted you to know what it was. How long do you think it's gonna to take to wash it? Like three minutes. Three minutes. Yeah. I'll three minutes. Three. I'm gonna um, take that spooler and stuff too. Mm. Oh, are you? Mm -hmm. You got plans, huh? Yes, I do. Got plans. Been waiting on this for a long time. I keep saying we gotta get more big brushes. Is that gonna come off the white stripe? Yeah. I kind of like the stripe. Yeah, shine the stripe up here. Right? The double brush move. I've already done that. That's rarely seen. You seem to have no uh, plan on like getting it all, just kind of getting it is your thing, huh? You gotta get it all, girl. I'm getting it all. Scooter, you better watch out. Scooter is very interested in helping with this project. He is the biggest rat hunter you've ever He's seen. Under He's, He's underneath there. Scoot. Where are you at, Scoot? Scoot, come here. Scooty, hey. Oh, you're so nasty already. I heard these have a six gallon gas tank. Six gallons? That's that what I heard. That won't get me to town. That's what I heard. They have six gallons. I have gallon. to carry a probably gas tank. Probably like 50 miles to a gallon. Maybe. Did I see a rat? Is there something falling? Or... If you paid money to go through a car wash with this, they ought to give you some change back. Yeah, really for sure. Is. I still don't know what's running out of the quarters, but it is nasty looking, whatever this stream is right here. Whatever it is, is running down from the fender as well. Found a leak, did you? Yeah. I Little knew it bubbly. Leaked. Yeah. May have to put some slime in there, huh? Or something? I feel like slime 
Yes. That was the quickest wash job ever. Yes. It usually takes us all day. On the spots where it's leaking this weird brown stuff, what brown water, is rusty. So I think that the poop is rusting it and pee. There's like weird. You spray it and then the brown stuff comes out. Yeah. Yeah. I think you're right. We're thinking that the bottoms of the fenders and quarters are packed with poo. I'm gonna have a big cleanup ahead of me. Ooh. That's what it is, isn't it? Yeah. The bottoms are just full of rat poo and stuff. I'm so smart. That's unfortunate. So Could be Coca-Cola. There's only one way to find out. It's not. So we're gonna clean these up. Hopefully they look like brand new when we get done. Got your quadruple ox steel wool. I don't say ox, so I think that's a weird word. Oh, okay. But zero, 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 zero. Still wool. That? All right. Oh my gosh, look at that. Like a brand new nickel right there is what that is. <laughs> that's gonna change it like crazy, isn't it? Yes. Look, it took all that off. Wow. Get y'all a piece and get your elbow yeah. grease down here. What that changes it? It goes like completely flat too, super shiny. Shining up good, Ralphie? Yeah. What are you doing this long sweep here? Are your little bumper ends clean up? Mm, they got some cracks no, it's good. or something in here, but I'm not. Mm, they got a crack, do they? Come it's showing up the side, though. Yeah, I mean, it looks better. It's just not like perfect, you know? I just love steel wool and chrome. It makes such a big difference. Look at that. Oh, look at the difference. This versus that. It's crazy. It's incredible how good it works. We've tried aluminum foil. People say use aluminum foil. I prefer oh. the steel wool though. And this is like right at the end of the small steel bumper era. I think 74 was the last year for these cars to have the small steel chrome bumpers. You your side doing good, Wawa? Yeah. It's good. incredible that we even have sides with this thing. Wow. Huge difference, Definitely right? Different. Mm -hmm. I don't know who put the lower spore on in the lots, but I don't think any of that's factory. What? I don't think any of that's factory. I Those think you're wrong. Comment below. I'm pretty sure it is. Comment below that sleeper dude's right. We need to mark this down. It's been the first time he's right if it is. I don't think that's factory. I don't think those are factory. Got your Crocs on? Always. And Crocs that's for life, time. huh? Yeah. Notice you don't walk in them much. Just saying, I walk in my... Reefs. I have heel spur. Oh, my bursitis. <laughs> Say bursitis is that oh. heel spur dingle dog. You shine up the emblem now, huh? I'm trying to. Hit. These are just as bad, if not worse. They are a little bit worse, I think. Think they're worse? This yeah, side's like getting good. I like using Comet and a little bit of water with it. Yeah. Seems to help. We could do that. That's working a lot. Oh, there's a little lock right here. Oh, is that where your license lamps are? I hope that some of these trim pieces are here. Yeah, we'll find them, I bet. I hope. I don't know how easy it is to get parts for a uh -oh. MG midget. I'm a little bit concerned about that. Probably should go ahead and order me a top. I mean, you're already wanting to order a top. It's not even running yet. Oh, I'm going to get it running. Okay. Well, maybe I'll do the brakes and you can get it running, but... Okay. Mm -hmm. It's an extra mile with this girl. Clearly. You don't work this hard on my cars. No, because I don't like none of your cars. This one's a jewel. Look at those bumpers now. We got to name this one. You got to name it? Yeah, we're going to name this one. So drop a comment below what you think we should name it. How about Money Pit? Alright, let's see what that does. You're just <laughs> making this thing too nice, honey. I'm telling you, it's a, it's a jewel. I've been waiting for this for 16 years. I didn't want to get rid of it in the first place. Kids gotta eat. That's true. <laughs> yeah, Golly, hey, 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 hey whoa, you whoa. Get your wet. <laughs> we took the gas cap off. You smell that? That's old gas. We know it's been about 17 years since it had oh, gas put in it. it so great. 
But that gas tank's gonna be perfect. Oh, it's oh, gonna look be at epic. It. Look, at look down there how rusty it is. Oh Lord. I can feel it coming off of this. I got a pheromone out there that needs that shined up too. <laughs> I ain't gonna have him, buddy. Looks painted, yeah. I don't know if that's gonna do anything. We'll probably have to repaint them or buy some different hoops for it. I'll repaint them. Budget, huh? Budget. Don't you be looking at me staying there. <laughs> Look right here. It's right here. I see it. Look. Uh, I'm gonna need new sub casings. Oh, golly, the envelope. Screw your life. We might can get these like a tractor supply or something off of like a wheelbarrow. See there? Hanging outside the box. Well, I guess it's time to get suited up and start doing the inside, huh? I'm not suiting up. I'm just gloving up and respirator. Okay. It's too hot for suit. Country girl can't survive. I'm gonna regret that later, aren't I? Yeah, you are. Great. I just saw a mouse. No, you did it. I just saw a mouse. You are kidding me. I saw it run this way, right across through there. Oh my gosh. There is 100% a mouse still in this vehicle. All right, well, I'm gonna let you go first. Scooter's on it in there. He is the best rat hunter in the world, like we said. I feel like we're gonna find a mouse in oh here. Oh my gosh. What I'm, I'm out of here, y'all. Wawa, come on now. I'm done. Are you the I'm done. Come on now. It, it's just a meese. Me and Scooter will do it. Yeah. Let's get started here, Scooty. Penelope, we need your help with this one, okay? Find the mice. She's a good mouse hunter too. I think Scooter wins the award though for best mouse hunter in the world. He is so on. If you sat him up there on the engine, he would be after it. I just had a discovery. What? Whatever it is, has rebuilt that hole. There was three. Oh, like, you're right. And there's down. a new one. Do you think they're in there? Yes. Oh. What is it, Scooty? Where's that? Where's the mice? Are they in there? Are they in there? Oh, is that a corn cob? It's a corn cob in there. All right, mom, get your car cleaned up. So we need to separate out like what's keep and what's junk. You worried? You're worried. They got a spare under there, don't we? Looks like it. Now we got a new jack out of this, huh? That's nice. We'll clean that bad boy up. Ralphie can use that or Wawa. That's I'm your trunk rack, isn't this. it? Yeah. So we could, should be able to just bolt that back on, huh? Once we get her going. Yeah, clean it up. Yeah. That's our passenger mirror we were missing. What is this? It's like a case to put the top in or what? You hear something? I keep thinking I hear something, but... I bet that goes over the top when it's down. Oh, yeah. It snaps, but it's no good. But it snaps over the top when it's down is what that is. That looks like. Stinks. Well, we knew we were going to get a new top. It might come with one, huh? That'd be awesome. I'm getting some work out of you, finally. You watch for him, okay? I'm watching. Are they going to hop out? Scooty is so wound up. He knows they're in here. We might have to put this on it. I think they're under there. You're brave, huh? Ew. This one looks like a better shape than this. Oh, it's better, maybe. Look how narrow that one looks. But on the car, they look kind of wide. So that's a 155.80, and these are 175.70.13. So it's the same hoop, different casings. What's that? That's your jack? It goes in the hole in the rocker. That's where it goes. We'll have to PB blast that thing up, man. Look how much rat man. urine has got on that and rusted it. I got some string beans in here. Go better run. Mama's coming. I have to rip you out by your ears. Scooter, his heart rate must be a thousand right now. He is so tall right. What is this? I don't know. Looks like maybe the base of your mirror. This has to be one of the worst cleanouts we've ever done. I know the 67 Thunderbird and the 87 Thunderbird were bad, but I think this one. We've never had one, I think, that they were still living in, you know? Like we yeah, saw a mouse. Yeah, and like we know, they was living in it because the, some of the stuff was green. Green, exactly. Yeah. It's crazy. Scooty, Scooty, calm down. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's your wiper we've been There's missing. My, oh, two wipers! Yeah, it's got three. We need one more. Man, what a mess. 
I don't want to throw my little whopper. They're so small. Yeah. Do you see it? Now, if this was a bee's nest. Yeah, you wouldn't be anywhere near it, huh? Anywhere near it, right? What is that? What is that? Is that a bone? Looks like a bone. <laughs> I swear, it looks like a bone, but it looks like it's been carved. What the heck? The trunk is deeper than I thought it would be. Yeah, she got a bigger trunk. For yeah, that girl. Oh, what in the world? There's bones in here. How did a bone that big get in there? That's like a third leg bone. Oh my gosh. What is dot in here? No, I don't think she needs a bone. There's a lot in there. That's the, oh, that's, that's the back, back one. Yeah. Man, we got we're finding all the stuff. Here's a oh, that's your lug wrench. Look how tiny that is. <laughs> yeah, you watching see if there's I'm watching. I think they're in the front. Well, I, I was just saying about little parts. I feel like there's oh. like little parts in here that I'm gonna Oh my gosh. That's just nastiness, isn't it? Look at that. It looks like it's the floor and it's not. Oh, look, look at the stuff moving around in there. I know. Gross. How many trash bags are we going to fill up with just nasty stuff? Our poor vacuum, right? This is awful. There's your other wiper. Oh, see? I didn't even see it. Look at that. We got all three wipers and our lights oh. and our mirror. Oh, there's your Emily MG emblem. You scared me to death. I'm sorry. You it's got your MG emblem. Do a cussy slip. Cussy slip? Don't do a cussy slip. Yay! I wonder why that stuff got taken off. He must have been going to polish it or something. I don't Maybe. Know. I'm glad you didn't let a cussy slip. It was close. You scared me. I'm on high alert and you're like, oh, look at there. And I was like, sorry, sorry. Look, he's up here now. He's searching. This thing's going to look so much better. I can't wait. This is like a ton of work, but I'm so excited about this car. But I'm... Wait, there's an emblem. Oh. See, I'm so worried that I'm gonna throw stuff away because it's so small. It's so small. Everything on this car is small, yeah. I hate your JBLs have got chewed up, you know? Hey, look. Look, that looks like it's at the bottom and then you realize it's like four inches deep in junk. We just buy the nicest cars, don't we? Absolutely. Think it's vacuum time? I don't know. We'll start vacuuming to see. We almost filled a whole tote up with just the poo and stuff. Not counting all the junk we got. That's crazy. Oh, that's a big one. Deep. That's the majority of look, they chewed right through the speaker wires that were in here. And look, they've been going in and out, I think, through here. Man. Well they better stay out, so I got to say. Does this come out? I feel like it's I hope so. I feel like it's glued down. Ooh. I don't know if this comes out. It's like glued down. Oh, she gonna come out. This is like you try to pull it hard enough to get it out, but not hard enough to sling stuff on you. Yeah. There we go. All right, let's vacuum this out now. Surprisingly, it looks like we still have a good floor. Definitely did not help it. It's really scaly. I wonder what we should spray on, like bleach? I think we're going to start with bleach just because I'm a bleach lover. I don't know if there's like something that kills whatever the acidity of the, the animal nastiness, but only hole I saw is right here. But we need to spray something on here to like deactivate the animal urine, you yeah. know? I don't know if just rinsing it out with water would help a lot. So mom says it's my turn to dig in here since I just saw a mouse up here. <laughs> So we don't even know what kind of intake this thing has or nothing. I guess we're gonna find out right here. Oh! 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 oh, oh, oh! There's one. You said mouse. That is a rat. That's a rat. Oh! Scooter, where did he come from? 
from? Oh, sweet Jesus. How Where'd are he you? come from? Oh. Where'd he come from, Scooter? Where'd he go? I think he's over this he's side. He's over here. I see him. Scooty, over here. He's behind the wheel. Oh, he's down there, Scooty. Scooty. Oh, he, he's under the car. Video. He's under the car. Look, look, look. He just hopped up on the transmission. Did you see it? No, I don't see it. He just hopped up under the transmission. Oh my gosh. Where's he gonna come out at? <gasps> he was under the car and stood up on the exhaust and hopped up onto the transmission. All right, Scooty, let's find this mouse, huh? Look, here's a, a full blown t shirt. Are you videoing from farther back? You said mouse. That, that was not what I was expecting. It was a rat, you're right. That thing is huge. Scooter is gonna help us watch for him. I'm a little bit scared to reach in here now. Well, you know what? Usually comes after the mice is the snakes. Uh -huh. Don't say that. Oh my gosh. That is the first time we've had a live animal. Live in. action. We got live action. I even yelled. Scooter is so on it right now. Look at this. What are they doing with these sticks in here? What can carry that under the hood? I could use a leaf blower, but then I don't want to blow this yeah, stuff I don't around want this, Yeah, I don't have to clean it up later. And look, what is this? It's this is crafty like... stuff they've gotten from somewhere, and... Whoa. Look at that. Oh my gosh, look at him. He stuck his head all the way in there. Yeah, the carburetor is full of this stuff, too. Wonderful news. That's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. I may have to start vacuuming, because I don't know where to reach and where... Yeah, if this was a snake, I would not be reaching down in here right now. That's for sure. I'm not afraid of, of mice or rats. I just hate the startling. They always startle me. It's like, yeah, they pop out of nowhere. I can't believe he popped out. I want to vacuum this because I can't really tell where else to dig. <gasps> it's a Weber. A side draft lever. That I don't think that's a factory setup. Oh my gosh! Look at that. They drug a whole shirt in there. So it's pretty deep down in here. How'd they get a whole shirt in there? Oh, here he's back again. We keep setting him down, and he keeps jumping back up in here. Can a rat carry a whole shirt? Something did. That's all rat poop up here. It has a small little valve cover, doesn't it? It's got a really small engine bay, but it like stops right here. I can't believe how deep this is. I don't know how far down this goes, but it's hot. I probably already vacuumed up six inches this and it's still going. So I'm going to say this is probably the worst one we've this done. This is definitely the worst one yet we've cleaned up, I think. We never had to run animals out to do it. This is the battery box, I think. That's where our battery goes. We're just gonna pressure wash this, I think. Out of here. And just keep stopping the vacuum up. It's just packed full. The whole fender is full. What in the world? Look at all that. That's unbelievable. Look, it's full. It's full all the way down. See here, it's just packed full. Every inch of this car is full of stuff. 
You think it just dropped it on the bottom? Like what's holding it? I don't know. How can a car that's so little hold so much stuff? Hold so much. This is crazy. Two and a half, three feet deep. On the top of this. That's awful. Here. You'd think this was sitting outside. This has been inside of a shed. Like, these leaves didn't blow up on it. Yeah, yeah. They've packed all this in here. This is animals moving in here, yeah. I don't know how we're going to ever empty these fenders out without taking them off the car at some point. Because this down here is absolutely full. We're going to have to take the fenders off of it at some point. I don't know if we could do much more than that without... I think we're just going to pressure wash it from here. We'll do the inside and then we'll pressure wash under here. So mama says it's time to pull the seats out of this thing. Absolutely. So, uh, looks like they bolt in from under the bottom, which is good for me. I'd rather not get underneath that seat. Look at all the stuff that's fell out under here while we were doing it. The last time I saw him, he was head up the transmission tunnel up there. Well, that's promising. The very first one, the bolt's spinning. One of them looks like it's broke off. One of them's spinning. One came out. And the other one, there's a piece of sheet metal in the way of me getting to it. That one's just spinning too. Rocky, you're supposed to be helping, not eating my plants. It's like where he can reach. Only where he He's can reach. He spilled them all down. He likes that banana tree, don't he? Rocky. Oh. I think I've got all but one out. Oh my gosh. Look at the seat belts. What they've done to the seat belt. Oh. Oh. I think this is the top lid off your breather. Oh, there's my headlight thing. Headlight rings. So we just got one here and it's spinning. What you find? Get it. Get it. Get it. Where is the mouse? So we're on our second large trash bag now. But this is all sticks and stuff. I've never seen such big sticks in any type of... You know, what animal brought these in here? A rat couldn't do that, right? I don't know. I think it's something bigger. I guess that's like a panel underneath the dash or something. At least it's got a roll bar since you're driving. Yeah. That mouse is going to run out of places to hide. Look at this. Look, he ate through it, and then there's a hole for him to go in now, behind it. How did he know where the hole was? we got to find this little guy at some point, huh? Little guy. He ain't little. Hmm, that's true. like sticking my hands under here but it's the only way I'm gonna get a seat out looks like I think I got it I don't know what the deal is here but this back bolt on the inside it's like the studs going through the floor and the frame rails right there the floor's been bent up a little bit and the nut it's kind of covered by the floor so i don't know if we're going to be able to get this out without just breaking the hole on the floor and fixing it later oh okay well that wasn't hard at all we got our license plate bracket well there's a whole t-shirt again what a mess it's in little pieces it goes so far up in there where your feet go. Where do you think that mouse is at? I don't know. It says MG2. stuff in there oh my gosh they've been like everywhere in this car
that's funny the carpet's like in little sections it's not like one big carpet it's a bunch of pieces i have to keep it in order i wonder what you could get a new carpet kit for yeah that's what i'm thinking it may not be that bad just get a new carpet kit for it i'll take my envelope wait you got an envelope <laughs> you've been using mine the whole time that's right hmm what is this a skull <gasps> Oh. What is that? Look, it has like, that's a skull, right? Yeah, because yeah, this is its mouth. What's the fang? I don't know. Oh my gosh. And that's in a totally different part of the car than the other ones, the other bones were. Um, so did they eat it? I don't know. Look how deep the poo is down oh there. Oh my gosh. There's your pedal. Look at that. I'm going to have to jump in the pool twice tonight to take a bath. That's not a bath. Yeah. Yeah. Comment below if a hot tub or a pool is the same as a bath. That's disgusting. Wow. I think this is the most poo right here. The floors seem to still be pretty solid on it, really. Considering what it's been through. Is there a floor mat under here? Ah, there is. That's probably what saved your floors right there. Probably. That floor mat. Wow. It's all wet, too. Look at the floors, though. I mean, they're solid. Look at they got paint on them. I think we've cleaned about all we can. It's really hard to get the vacuum in some of the spots underneath this hood. I believe we're gonna pressure wash under the hood and then maybe rinse out the back. What do you think, Mom? I think that's a good idea. We'll probably spray some bleach in here or something. I don't really smell it. I, I did when we I'm first not, got out here. I'm not, like, trying to smell it, but I don't smell it, but it's just nasty. Got a camper top for the truck. Used on Marketplace. Screaming deal. So we have got to go take Squeezy out for her birthday. And we will come back tomorrow and start pressure washing this because you got to have priorities in life, right? Yeah. You know, Squeezy's important. She's turning a big 10. It is cold out here. It's chilly. So it's the next day. It's starting to get cold weather now. We're, we're running out of daylight sooner. I hate it. So we got to take Squeezy to the Chinese buffet. All the way an hour drive to the Chinese buffet. It had to be that Ridiculous. one. Ridiculous. So <laughs> that got delayed a little bit. And we had a little bit of an emergency yesterday. Apparently, Puddin got bit by something, and we rushed her to the vet yesterday, and unfortunately, Puddin didn't make it. So, Puddin's not going to be in the videos anymore. We uh, we tried everything we could do, uh, took her to the vet, and it didn't turn out well. So. so, it's just something you have to deal with when you have a bunch of animals. Sometimes this happens, but we don't know what bit her, but... Puddin got bit by something yesterday in the field, and uh, she just, we found her. She wasn't moving around, and then she just went completely limp. Uh, after several hours of trying to help her with the vet, it just didn't work out. So, first animal we've lost on the channel. So, just thought we'd let you guys know that's why we got delayed today. So, mom was real sad about it. We're all sad about it. We all love Puddin. So, Anyway, we gotta get back to cleaning this car. We just thought we'd let you guys know what happened. I don't think I've ever seen a car with such a small engine, but look at this little fan. Look how tiny this little plastic fan is, too. Everything, oh my gosh. Everything about it is so tiny. I really don't want to just splash this stuff all over everything, so I'm gonna go with low pressure first just to try to knock some of the big stuff off. All the pictures I've seen, I believe this is an aftermarket setup. I think they had two carburetors from the factory. Oh, it's so gross. I think you're just gonna blast it. This is just a recipe for rusting the car out right here. I wonder who took the battery out of it. Ah. We just can't get cars that have batteries. The red is intake, the white is exhaust. Oh, I like the intake and the exhaust is red a lot. Look, it's funny, it shares a center exhaust port like a flathead ford does that's funny so that's the main harness for the car it's inside all this 
It, it doesn't look like they eat it up there. I was gonna say, does it look like they chew it all out? It doesn't, which is odd to me. Usually they go right for the wiring. I see where they chewed on the plug wires, mm -hmm. but I don't see where they chewed on the normal harness. I'm gonna have to do it full blast on her. Yeah. It's not doing a whole lot here. Nope. Oh, great. I'm gonna get it all over me. So we're gonna give everything another coat here. And uh, I guess I'm gonna hit it with a real pressure washer and get completely nasty again like yesterday. I'm not looking forward to this. job yeah i think that's about <laughs> all we can do for now definitely the bottoms of the fenders are gonna have to be cleaned out probably gonna be after we get it running driving we're gonna have to pull the fenders off at some point they're still got junk down in there I and mean, i can't see it from here but you know there's got to be stuff there in there <laughs> but look you can definitely tell that i own this car before oh remember i gosh. told you i had the valve cover off look at that you I, had, I was 19 years old okay Take it and easy did, did things change though I Some put, things I never put it changed. on a little thinner now. We do need to probably pressure wash the carpet and junk. Are we gonna replace I'm it? I'm not planning on putting it back in there. Okay, cool, this cool. is my car. But we still got brown goo pouring out the fenders. Look at all the trash that blew out of that. We're gonna have to have our driveway redone after this. Oh my god. That is so nasty. Look up here, you still got what oh handfuls god. of stuff. They're completely packed. There's a, there's probably a foot and a half of junk packed in these fenders. That's like, these fenders are not gonna last like that. It is the carburetor free. This is a big moment here. Hey, the carburetor's there's still. There's hope for the old girl yet. Yeah, carburetor, I can't believe that considering it had all that mess inside of it. There's a close up on the numbers. The brown goo. I think we should do like a complimentary rinse. Oh. <laughs> And then a bleach. Cool. Is there a place to drain or do we need to put a drain oh. hole? Here we go. Yeah. Is there a rich drain hole up there? We'll make one if there's not. How about that? Yes, please. Turns brown when you start to rinse it off. I don't think there's a drain hole up there. Uh, look at the drill. Hey, look at that. Look at, that. Look at the color of the water coming out of that. That, that is so disgusting. I'm surprised it's holding water so well. She's getting a new drain hole here. Oh, wow. That wasn't hard. I almost had one already. Oh, Lord. I'll hit it with a bleach and I'll feel good about it. We're just gonna try to stay off the dash, you know. Yeah. This car, hopefully the dash, <laughs> hopefully it's good under there still. All right, on to this tiny little trunk. Uh, it does have a little bit of a self-draining hole there. Look at how brown it is on it. Hey, what are you doing? I think we've cleaned up some cars that were nasty. I think this car is nasty though. Nasty. Maybe. Real nasty. About 
add the vinegar to it. All right, and that's supposed to kill the nasty yes. smell and stuff? Yes. Okay. So it's just going to smell like vinegar instead of, <laughs> instead of rat pee? Rat. Vinegar is really actually a good cleaner. Isn't it like the main ingredient in most cleaners? Man, aggressive. Just for good measure. After a little. Oh, that, it's reacting. We have a science project now. I think you just made a volcano. Rinse it. Rinse it? I'm gonna give it the. Oh god. Yeah. The beans and the taters? Beans, taters, onions. Rocky, hard at work. You better get out of here. You're in there, I'm coming. Uh, you're gonna scare him away. Somebody's gonna scare somebody. How are we still digging stuff out of here? I don't know. Never in my life. I mean, all the nice cars I buy, and look what you buy. Oh my lord, this is a bunch. Oh, it's wet. Looks like my wires. Oh no, your talents probably don't work. I found a spark plug. Really? This don't go this car, it's too big. I know that's too big. <laughs> Has to be. Or does it just have one? Have one big one? One big spark plug? Yeah. No, it has four. It's four cylinder. What's that for then? That's probably for this car. It's humongous. I thought it'd have like a, like a dirt bike one or something. No. Oh, that's a good one. How nasty that is. So. Clean out your cracks. Gotta clean your cracks. We're gonna clean these seats up, clean up our luggage rack and our jack and our spare. We got our MG mats. They put their name on everything, didn't they? It even says midget on it. Oh, that's so cool. Shoot, I smell those mats from here. Can you believe the seats survived? Why didn't they like the seats? Usually the seats get chewed up. Now this is just a pre-wash. We're gonna wash it in more detail. This is just to get the big stuff off. I'm glad she clarified that. Oh, your color's coming off right there a little bit. At least they're rubber mats. Dude, look at that stuff coming off of them. Nicey. Nicey. Nicey, nicey. Normally I would say it's nastier than the girls at the, but I can't think of a place that's that nasty. <laughs> you ain't never been to a place that nasty, baby. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna polish him up. I wonder why that was a different car. I just thought all the parts were in it. I know, I was worried. I think we're going to let it dry a little bit and we're going to come back and clean these seats with some cleaner, clean the door panels and dash once everything's dry. Probably have to vacuum out a little bit more, don't you think? Oh, there's your boy. He's a good boy. It looks like somebody has dyed these seats, we believe, because it looks like they used to be tan and they have dyed them black. The little engine does look pretty clean, you know? Has it got a brass intake? Is that brass? It sure looks like it. I cannot believe they didn't eat the wiring harness up. Most everything we're seeing with the wiring harness looks solid still. Considering. Maybe we can get some brakes working. I hope I don't have to rebuild the entire brake system again. Maybe I can get some brakes working, you reckon? You might. Don't eat my plants. He wasn't eating anything. What are you talking about? <laughs> well, it's had a few hours here to dry out. We now are probably going to vacuum out some of this niceness back here. Oh, look, we got a new hole. That's cool. Maybe at that point, Wawa will be okay to come back around the car, you know? She was scared of that rat, wasn't she? For sure. Yeah, and she, she wouldn't have no part of it. I'd feel a lot better if we actually had like seen the dude him somewhere or like else. saw him run off yeah. those door panels look spot on i mean what's better the zephyr door panels or your door panels Man. i think that's the smallest door panel we've ever had on the channel <laughs> little. i do love the little door handle is that your lock i think that may be your lock we're so unused to these european cars we have no idea how anything works everything's probably totally backwards of what we're used to all the uh european fans are like all you have to do is do this <laughs> that was probably a terrible accent they're like that doesn't that's not what we sound like 
It's like when they try to do a southern accent. Never sounds like a southern accent to me. This is gonna be a fun one to drive, isn't it? It's gonna be awesome. I can't wait. Once we get it. I love my little cars. I'm much more a fan of small cars than big cars. Yeah. Unless I'm cruising. It's good to have a cruiser. Uh, big cruiser, that's true. No mice poop on me. There ain't no mice poop on me. I'm gonna shine this thing up. And what's it gonna take to get you to clean a pheromone up this good? Uh, I'll video you, how about that? <laughs> I just pulled on something. Oh. I think we got more stuff in there. If that rat pops out, I'm gonna laugh my head off. We're gonna be finding leaves and twigs if it, if for years. Like Will the steering wheel clean up? My guess, it looks like it's peeling and it's not gonna clean up. We may have to paint the spokes or something. Probably gonna have to be painted, painted or something. Big windshield. Golly, listen, we ain't sponsored by them. So I gotta go back there. to the Dollar General if you keep this up. You're getting to shine up. Is the glass got any I don't see any bubbling in the windshield or anything. Hey, we got a good windshield in a car. We're at the home stretch now. We're doing good. You know? This thing's gonna look so good. Right in there was the worst part, wasn't it? Yeah, I think there might've been a dead right there at one point or something. Got the super clean on this. Is that stainless or chrome? It almost looks like it's stainless. Steel wool, magic razor, you can clean anything. That's true. What is that? I'm not sure what that was. It was in the trunks, so there's no telling. No telling. It smells nice and bleachy in here. Yeah, it smells a lot better in here. So the rat turd sucker 9000 here has slowed down. I think <gasps> she's full. Oh my lord. Look, all the way down to where the filter was. No wonder it was slowing down. Poor thing. We're gonna have to do a little transfer here. This is definitely the most we've ever put in this vacuum in one, out of one car. Look, we fill up that trash bag, this trash bag, and this. All right, let's see what's under this mess. dirt report huh <laughs> i think it's finally safe enough for the children's to check it out look under here now oh wow oh wow oh scooter yeah oh my lord and we crazy. we still have junk down in the fenders we're gonna have to take the fenders off at some point it looks, looks really good. nice love it looks way better doesn't it i mean this was like you know all this was packed up to here see the yeah we're gonna replace the carpet the wow. top are you just gonna fix it up or something? Yeah, that's well, mom's. Hey, now, be riding around and non fixed up. I love a little shifter, like just moving the shifter around and stuff is pretty cool. Yeah. But the door panels are still good. The seats are pretty good. What does the trunk look like? Oh, here you go. Big reveal. Oh wow. oh wow. But we still we got some surface rust here. This is probably the rustiest part of the car. This must have been the bathroom here. I'm thinking. What do you guys probably. think? Probably. That's probably valid. Well, that that's debatable with the part on the. Fenders? Yeah. Maybe rats don't have a designated bathroom. I don't think that's probably accurate. What do you think the percentage chances that the rat still is in the car? 30. 30. He jumped on my top of the transmission last I saw him. Why don't we get the seats in this thing and y'all can sit in. Maybe we can uh, push it around or something. Okay. <laughs> it's so like, tiny, huh? It's like, what am I doing in this car? <laughs> I love it. Honestly. I love it. The door panels are awesome. Yeah, they look pretty good, don't they? Can you smell bleach or what? Bleach. You smell rat pee? No. Okay. <laughs> yeah. We got to order some carpet because Mama says we're not cleaning that carpet up. I don't think I'm gonna bolt them in until we get our carpet. You know? Yeah, that's a good idea. But you're jumping right in. <laughs> it's got a lot of gauges. Yeah. That's white, Dad. What? That is? Yeah. There's many. <laughs> Where in the world? That's the coolest little car. Yeah. Oh my gosh, your feet like go like way too far up. It's weird, huh? I really like this car. I would drive this so fast. 
<laughs> this is exactly why you're not driving this. With those mats in there, you can't hardly even tell it don't have carpet in it. Push the clutch in. Oh, you rolled a little bit. Can you push you guys in it? Oh, you shifted it? I don't, you know what? The shifter's great, isn't it? I'm surprised the hydraulic clutch still works. <laughs> How many weights are we gonna get? You ready to go for a ride? Yeah. Oh, oh, what are you turning it for? No, no don't turn it, don't turn it. Other way, we're going up the hill. Look, we found all these bones in it. What? And what? What did that? Ew, like, why does that have lines on? That it? is just nice. Look, this is a skull from some animal. I don't know what that's off of, but. It's like a big old rat. Is what it looks. That's like. like a darn thigh bones connected to your hip bone. This is a hard way to do a first drive. Right, without a clutch. At least the clutch works, huh? That's yeah. awesome. You like them four speeds, don't you? Oh yeah. Okay. I think once we get the seat where we can slide it forward and back, that'll help out too. That goes right that there. So Ain't that awesome? And we found the MG emblem in the back too. Oh, great. Wait. Pop up camper road trip. Pop up. Pop up camper with this. <laughs> where are we gonna ride? Where are we gonna ride? There's only it's only two seats. I don't think this is gonna pull any pop up campers. <laughs> it's four cylinder. It'll get you anywhere. You take that plug out. This goes in there and it picks the car up on this side. It picks. We gotta use it. This is probably the center of gravity for this side, so we'll have to use that. That's huh? Awesome. I love how that setup is. Well, guys, I hope you liked this video. It's kind of unfortunate that the kids weren't able to help us more in this thing because this car is just too nasty. Too nasty. I mean, it was nasty. Okay. Nasty. We didn't want anybody getting sick. Me and Mom wore our masks and our gloves, so. We tried to be as safe as we could. Here we go. Look at me. I'm a pro at this. You thought it was going to blow out. She did. She was worried about it. So what do you guys think about the car? Do you love, love it? Hate it? it? Love, love it. Love it. Love it. How come hey. you don't... Get out of here. Hey. What, what are you doing? There's a hawk. I'm going to get my chicken. A hawk? What's a... Look at it. What's a hawk? <laughs> How come you guys don't cheer like that for my Fairmonts when I buy them? Uh, because they're UGLY. I like the Mercury Zephyr. Yeah, that's my boy right there. I like this too. Next video you should see on this car is a will it start on it. We've already ordered some parts, but we're going to have to find out what we need for that carburetor because it's not the original carburetor for the car. We're going to have to find uh, a kit for that somewhere. Are you pouring one out for your homie squeeze? I think this goes down as the nastiest car we've ever cleaned up. It was bad. I didn't I think mean, it was going to be that bad. No. I didn't think it was going to be worse than the rat car, 87 Thunderbird, or... It's the only one that we've seen like seen an actual rat in right right or the possum car 67 thunderbird but both of those it was like they'd already moved out yeah, yeah. this was like Active. we seen him i mean he was on top he jumped out there at me i i'm lucky to be alive right now i hope he jumped his little butt out we don't want to deal with him anymore mom can't wait to get this thing running uh it ought to be pretty fun to drive hopefully we can get some brakes working you know That'd be it'd be nice to get at least some brakes working enough where we could drive it when we get it running if not, it's kind of hard to find parts for the brakes. I've been looking for brake parts for it, and I can find some of them, but not all of them. You can check us out on our second channel at Sleeper Dude 2. You guys are getting better at that. You can check us out on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok at Sleeper Dude 88. You can buy our merchandise down below. We don't have a website. Don't go looking for it. True that. I can just see you now carving up the roads and the mountains in this thing. Hey, I'm going to drive it soon. This would be a perfect tail of the dragon car, wouldn't it? Yeah, if I'm driving. Driving? Um, um. Oh, you just ate? He probably had a crouton and he's full. <laughs> I'll have to share them with Rocky then. Yeah. As always, we appreciate you guys watching. Yeah. If it wasn't for you, we wouldn't be able to do this. It's incredible the amount of views we get. Thank you so much for that. We appreciate all the people that do super thanks, super chat when we do our live streams. All that really helps out and we really do appreciate it. So future events we're going to be at, uh, we are going to be at Ford Fest, which is... What is that, like the 20... The last weekend in September, like the 28th, yeah. 29th. So if Saturday. you want to come out and see us at Ford Fest, we'll be there. We'll be running the Super Coupe, hopefully. We're going to do some more upgrades to it and try to get it there. Uh, we always love going to Beach Bend. That is a, no matter what event's going on, Beach facility. Bend is an awesome place huh? to go. Really sad deal with Pudding. Uh, I hated that that happened. Uh, it's just something that goes on when you have a lot of animals. I mean, we... 
she's seen the vets, you know, we did all the right things and things still happen. You never know, you know, it's just part of it. Unfortunately, we're all sad about losing pudding in this video, but, but let's go give Rocky his Vanyas and give Vanya her RC Cola. You got to get out of the car, son, at some point. Come on now. Can't get the door open. Oh, Wawa just broke the other door. Rocky's on the run already. Look at Vanya. They know what's going on, don't you? I love her run. She has the best run. There you go, Rocky. We didn't forget about you. Granny won't eat them, right? I don't think so. We'll try. Granny? She says, I tried those in 62. Oh. No way. They're all coming around to me. What is the deal? Used to, we couldn't get any of them to do that. Oh, look, she ain't got no teeth. Wow. She says, I tried those in 62. <laughs> That's the bourbon barbecue flavor. Oh, man. She's on it now. They're all figuring out what to do. Poor right, mama. Hey, give me some. Give me some, All right, Granny, last now, one. Now, don't drink all Vainia's RC Cola. She's waiting oh, patiently over there. There you go. Mm. I wonder. I bet she would be this way with any drink whatsoever. Literally yeah. any drink. Anything. I, I bet anything you give her. Like, that old girl's like, what are you doing? Have you ever seen anything she won't eat or drink? No. 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 I guess that's just a pig thing, right? I think that's a pig thing. Uh, let me know in the comments if you like the Rocky Cam. He did pretty good with it, didn't he? Yeah. Good boy. He's a good boy. He'll bite your fingers off for that bourbon barbecue juice on your I fingers. Tell him bye. Bye. <laughs> How do you do all that? I can't do that. Bye, homies. Oh, God. Peace, Peace out. Cool. Bye. I can't cross my eyes. Sorry. This is a lug wrench. Can is that you the smallest that? thing ever? It's like the size of my hand. It it's, is. It's the lug wrench. You like it? I love it. I've always loved it. Man, you're in there, aren't you? <laughs> it's so little. <laughs>